guys and welcome back to my channel again in another cool video and a cool engine do you know guys most of you or all of you uh, knows the noble m600 uh, supercar or sports car this car is amazing the engine of it is, is very good uh, the engine is made by Yamaha and it's a Volvo engine the the name of the engine is Volvo B8444S, which is a a 4.4 a or a 4,414 cc engine, 60 degrees V8. So I'm gonna make it right now and uh, hope that I can that I can make a close replica or a fully on replica of the V8 in the Noble M600. <clears throat> so let's start. V60 degrees 8 aluminium. Uh, and let's let's put the bore to 94 millimeter and the stroke for 779.5 yes for 4414 correct and the engine uses a let's see specification all right then the engine uses a dual overhead cam with uh, four valves per cylinder aluminium head the engine doesn't use a variable front lift all right forged i beam and lightweight plus five right and then next now the original engine uses a 10.7 to 1 compression ratio but the M600 they, they reduced and they made the compression lower than before because they will use turbos and uh, higher compression with turbo doesn't really work that good so 9.5 to 1 for the Noble M600 and let's see the cam profile should be around 65 Variable valve timing, yes it has for all cams of course and plus five and yes twin turbo with ball bearing let's see large performance and plus five I'm gonna adjust it later uh, injection multi-point twin turbo or not twin turbo twin throttle body and let's see Yes, twin throttle body performance and 95, 13 and a half. Reduce the ignition timing 7000 plus 5 and dual exhaust. And let's see, we are hoping for we are hoping for 650 horsepower. So, yes, that's correct. Um, straight, straight through, straight through plus five and you can see the engine is knocking so let's reduce the boost so we can make it <coughs> make it more to produce more horsepower all right i mean noble did something really amazing with this engine but I'm not really sure here because the specs doesn't say if the engine is running on EFI or DFI or DFI so um, let me search for it um, I think the M600 is running on EFI not DFI okay let's continue with EFI for now let's um, how much fuel do we have let me push more fuel in right and now let's hit let's try and hit the 650 point let's try to hit it all right so 616 right and uh, let's see the ignition timing come on I want the 650 
Yes, 650 horsepower. 650 horsepower. Now that's correct. Now let's see. I want to let me search in the in the spec sheet for the for the max RPM. How much do you think the it, it will rev? I mean, yes, the engine can rev up to 8,000. Let's go for 8,000 and... Hmm. Let's reduce the boost a little. Yes, now 650 is good. Now let's hear the engine. Yes, let's hear it right now. Now I'm reading right now the the Wikipedia uh, description description about the engine and the transmission. In the Google search, they said the engine the engine produced in the track setting uh, 650 horsepower, but inside Wikipedia they said it produced 660 brake horsepower. So yes, I think we have to uh, we have to boost it. We have to boost it, my friend, to 660. Mm -hmm. How can I find the, the exhaust? No. No. Alright, let's use a... Here. Yeah. A better camshaft here, yes, but now we are knocking, so... Yes, 660 horsepower. Now we are running it correctly. Now in Wikipedia, they, are, they said the engine has a compression ratio of 9.5 to 1, which I think we did it. Yes, and uh, they said it uses an an or an or Lincoln Grazi Grazi. What the hell, Gra Graziano transaxle six-speed manual gearbox, and has an RPM redline set to seven thousand. Oh, that's gonna be difficult. So six, seven thousand only, and the gearbox and the RPM redline set to seven thousand. So we need to produce. Oh crap! Now that's not good. So I have to use the A ninety-eight. And yes, now we are using it correctly. Oh, wow, we're good. Oh, come on. Yes, now we're, we're running good. Hmm. Yes. Now we are having 660 horsepower, 540 pound feet of torque. So now we are running it correctly according to Wikipedia, according to all the factory, according to all the factory specs. So this engine has is, again. I will type the engine name, which is Volvo. Volvo 
um, B8444S M600 Turbo. Yes, it's correctly. And let's say we are, we have we are having a fully on replica, my friend. Replica, correct replica from 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 Wikipedia according to Wikipedia specs. So let's hear it again. I will try and use the normal forged pistons, see if I can... Alright, so did we gain anything? More reliability? Let's see, any difference? No, no difference, I'm gonna use the... Okay, let's keep it light so I can gain more smoothness and gain l lighter weight. So as, so as you saw it guys, this is the M600 V8 twin turbo engine made by Yamaha and previously known for the or previously used in the Volvo XC90 SUV and the S80 according to Wikipedia so th this engine uses a twin Garrett turbocharger equipped with uh, yes everything and 454 road 554 sport and 664 racing so yes th this engine can uh, if this engine was uh, What's in the real noble? The noble will have a, a computer switch that you can use the use it in the road for five four hundred and fifty horsepower only for fifty tune and for the for a sport setting you can use it five fifty and six sixty for the track. So this is the M six hundred guys or the M six hundred engine. Thank you so much, guys. Th thank you so much for watching. If you like this engine, please hit that like video and uh, consider subscribing and hit that subscribe button to, to, to see more cool videos from Automotion and uh, Car Mechanics Simulator 2018. Please, if you, if, you have a, if you have a request that Automation can support it, please feel free and write it down in the comment and I will make it. Thank you so much guys for watching. I will see you in another video. Bye bye.